And the Bible tells us that the early church was sick for one reason, for this, not this, but this singular reason. Many were sick, many were falling asleep before their time. I kind of wish they didn't say many, for one singular reason, not discerning the Lord's body. And that's why I endeavor that every Sunday we have communion. And especially when we come to the bread, that's neglected all over the world. Many mainstream churches that partake, if they do partake, they focus more on the cup. But the Bible says it's not discerning the body that's causing the problem. Why are there two elements? When the blood is taken from the body, there's death. The Lord's Supper is not about His resurrection. It's about His death. It's proclaiming the Lord's death till He comes. Amen. So why the two elements? Well, friend, by His stripes, your cancer died. By His stripes, your blood pressure is normalized. By His stripes, all the blockage in your arteries are cleared. By His stripes, you have brand new kidneys. By His stripe, your youth is renewed like the eagles. The whole fall happened. If you ask, well, Pastor Prince, just by mere eating, can health come to my body? The whole fall happened because of eating. So God puts a premium in what you eat. Let's eat the food of the champions. The body of our Lord, He said, my flesh is meat indeed, and my drink is drink indeed. Are you ready? Lift it up before the Lord. Say, Lord Jesus, by your stripe, by your stripe, I am healed, made every wheat whole. My youth and strength is renewed like the eagles. My body is restored to that of a young man, a young woman. By your stripe, through your grace, I will live to be 120. My eyes not dim, my strength not abated. Completely strong and healthy. Partake. We trust healing is taking place. All those of you who are watching via television, in the name of the Lord Jesus, healing be in that body right now, in the name of the Lord Jesus. Friend, you have partaken the very reason that God releases healing today. God cannot release healing in the body of a sinner without a righteous foundation. But God has found the ransom. God has found the righteous foundation. And the blood that we demonstrate right now has been shed, giving you, regardless of how much you think you've sinned against God, how far away you are from God, if you come trusting the work of His Son, the blood that has been shed, God has a righteous foundation to heal your body. Amen. And God wants you well. I said, God wants you well. Amen. Amen. And the righteous foundation is this. Jesus took the cup and said, this blood of the new covenant, this cup is the blood of the new covenant for the forgiveness, the sending away, the remission of sins. In other words, when you drink this cup, you must not drink conscious of your sin still in your body, but you must drink in consciousness that it is sent away. Like the scapegoat carries away your sin. Christ has taken away your sins. Drink. Amen, amen, amen. Are you blessed?